guys, in the famous words of Henry Wadsworth Longfellow, today we're going to talk about the universal language of mankind, it's music. The song does remember when, and we're going to talk about that today. We're sitting here at Hanks. Hanks. I'm not sure if you can see that above us. <laughs> Hanks in Murfreesboro. It's an awesome place to come. It's across from Sports Com on Memorial Boulevard at the Treasure Shopping Center. Yeah, if One you're of the spots in Murfreesboro. Definitely. If you're in the Middle Tennessee area, you do not have to go to Nashville to Honky Tonk. You can come right here to Murfreesboro at Hanks. He's got it figured out. It's packed on Friday and Saturday nights. We got Miss Tina back here behind the bar helping us out today with some cocktails. What's your favorite cocktail? Is it our coffee mug? Um, well, I have a lot of favorite cocktails. One of mine lately is Dice Lucy Jack. That works really well for me. What about you? Rebecca and I are getting ready to do a tequila shot. I'm a huge fan of tequila for a shot because I'm off the soda. So. We won't tell you what time it is, but we are doing tequila <laughs> shots. Right now, it hangs. Okay. And a honky tonk. I'm a Jack and Diet girl. I think I mentioned that on a show before. So, anyway, we could not come in a honky tonk without getting our drink on. Yeah. 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 And doesn't Hank every now and then have a celebrity show up, walk in? Yesterday, Colin Ray was here. You know Colin Ray? He sings uh, so many great songs, but the one that always stands out to me is Little Rock. Yeah. I think I'm on the road here in Little Rock. So, he was here yesterday. He got up and sang five songs. Um, his keyboard player, the O'Donnells, was here playing, and so he came in and popped here. So you never know who you're going to see here. Far Cry's played here several times. They packed the joint. They packed the joint. Yes. Oh my gosh, yes. yes. It's been known that he has to hire extra servers on the night Far Cry plays. <laughs> um, so come check this out. It's a beautiful place. You can see it's fully stocked bar, great servers. Like I said, Christina's here with us. Ken and Gina Strode own Hanks. They opened this back in. Was Murphy's were ready for it because it is packed. Yeah, all it the time. is. Yeah. All right, so we're going to talk a little bit about music. What songs stand out to you guys? I know you don't. You're not a fan of country music. I can't stand country music. Let's just go ahead and get it. You can't stand cats or country music. <laughs> <laughs> you see, yeah, cats and country music. I can't stand either one. If there's country music playing now, and it literally sounds like. Nails on chalkboard. Wow. Oh, okay. That's a keyboard shot. I'll help her. Um, <laughs> but what song do you love? Because we're talking about music in general. Yeah. I um, I listen to pretty much everything but country. But I am an '80s queen. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Music can take you right back to a memory, a place in time, and I blare it on my radio. Got it going um, when I leave here, and it takes me right back to high school. Love it. I love '80s too. I love Yacht Rock Radio. That's a great station for classic rock. There's a classic rewind station on satellite too that you like. I I have two songs I want to mention. One I mentioned a song remembers when Trisha Yearwood, what great lyrics, which really um, encompasses everything we're talking about today. When you hear a song, it takes you back to a memory. The song remembers when it takes you there. Your body goes back in time. Your emotions come to the surface. Music is incredible. I this is it. water, by the way. Oh, not okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Good to know. That would be a lot of Sorry, yeah, I'll take that. Okay. Oh, she, well, I was going to mention Alan Jackson's Where Were You When the World Stopped Turning. That always takes me back to 9 11. And it seems like a discussion always seems about everybody remembers where they went when that, those right. events happened. We so talked about that. Before. We did talk about that. Yeah. Yeah. I love the song I Can Only Imagine. Every time that song oh, comes on the radio, I just. I almost forget about where I am and what I'm doing, and I just listen to the words. I love yes. the words. And an awesome okay. movie, too, I can only imagine. Yes. Yes. Awesome movie if you yes. haven't seen it. Yes. And then Rebecca, as a child of the 80s, I love Prince. That's probably like it's 1999. Back in the 80s, that was so far in the future. But now it's a great yeah. now it's yeah. 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 So is Prince, yeah. unfortunately. Yeah. Wow, what an entertainer. I love Little Rebecca. Yeah. So music can boost your moods. It can um, relax yeah. you. Yeah, yeah, I was into classical and new age to go to sleep. One of my favorite songs I ever remember, and of course growing up, I was around music. Any, everybody was around music. But the first time I felt like I stopped in my tracks was when I heard Joe Dippy's song, The Devil Dance and Get Your Pockets. And that's when I really went, wow, somebody wrote that. Somebody created those lyrics. And it, it, immediately my brain shifted to writing songs. And so that's, why I, that's one of my first songs I remember that took me to it in a creative level. And I will tell yeah. you, our sister Carrie here is an amazing songwriter. Um, yeah. Amazing. God yes. has given her a real talent with writing music. So 
so I appreciate that shout out. Yes. You know, I've always, I love all types of music, but I really, really, my favorite artists, if we think about individuals, my favorite artists are those that can also write and sing. Because to me, to be able to write a song is just incredible because words connect. Um, words bring an emotional perspective, whether it's a sad song, an upbeat song, very true. Whatever genre you're listening to, those words bring something to you. And that is an incredible talent. Oh, this is here we incredible go. talent, too, we're about to see. I think. <laughs> hey, hey, yeah, let's do a little touch. Yeah. 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 yeah, music is amazing. Cheers and yeah. we want to talk a little bit more, too. Yeah. So, again, Hanks is um, out in the Kroger Shopping Center across from Sportscom in Murfreesboro um, on Memorial Boulevard. You're going to want to come here. If you're coming on a Friday and Saturday night, you better get here early. It's always hot. He has amazing talent booked here. Always looking for more amazing talent. Right. And um, Ken, you have to behind us. Do you have your songwriter nights yet? We do open mic on Monday. Open oh, mic oh, on Monday oh, nights. Oh, right. And so, Oh, yeah, well, we need to come out here and do this. Maybe I'll try to get in on the show. There you go. Yeah. Let's do it. Yeah. yeah, this is beautiful. He's got it set up. You're going to feel like a honky tonk. It's one of those places, it's like cheers. Once you start coming here, you know, you start you feeling like everybody knows your name. It's a great feel. Cozy, hometown, honky tonk feel to it. Yeah. Feels like a place you'd want to come and hang out for a while. Speaking of hanging out, we're going to do lunch here when the show's over because they have great food also. They open at noon during the week, and they're open on, on weekends all the way until, I think, midnight. So come try out a yep. Yeah. All right, where's our help tip, Rebecca? Oh, oh, we got a help tip. All right. I'm going to give you While milk. we have our libation. All right, yeah. Y'all have your, your adult beverages. And, um, <laughs> yeah, so real quick, two things, help tip. If you're having to study for a test, bring it back to music. Listen to classical music. Um, definitely a little Beethoven. Your brain is a parallel processor and it will help you do better on exams. So anyway, that's just a little bit of something. Now, about three or four shows ago, we had talked about, some mentioned, don't ever put your purse, carry I believe it was you, on the countertop because it is dirty. Or the floors. Or the floors, yes. So, that is so true. This purse weighs 40 pounds. <laughs> it is a purse, not to be confused with a suitcase. And can't I can run away, but run away. Research shows that we will Stop it. Research shows that um, on the on the bottom of purses, there one out of four purses has E. coli, which is an intestinal bacteria. Okay, that comes from poop. One out of four. Some purses are dirtier than a toilet, depending on how often you clean them. They're leather, which means that they're porous, which they hold bacteria. So once a day. Just get a wet one, wipe off the bottom of your purse, don't put your purse on the floor. Does that fit in the overhead compartment? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not, not sure. sure. Yes. <laughs> Listen, go to go to Hallmark, get those little clips, yes. carry it in your purse, you can clip it to your tables at lunch and hang your purse. A lot of clubs now, and I don't know if Hanks does or not, they have those clips under the bar where you can hang your, if you're in a bar a lot, <laughs> you can hang your purse. Yeah. 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 That's a so great tip. It is a good tip. All right. Thank you all. Um, one of our fans, Tayana Young, I know made this for me, for us. Thank you all. Thank you all for your support of our show. It is really wonderful. And thank you for yes. all the gifts. Thank you, thank you, thank yes, you. Yes, I just got one, too, that Lisa and Judy gave me. It says, let's soar. It's beautiful. Um, opalescent kind of. It's hanging in my office. So y'all send us stuff. We like stuff. Yeah, let's I think soar. Kathleen and Sheila need a gift. Yes. Yeah, somebody <laughs> said you can't pat Sheila yet. Yeah. Yes, we got coffee mugs from Patty, which we're always oh, thankful for. Yeah. And now we're getting pictures. Um, I, I wear like, a, you know, giving our sizes and stuff. <laughs> size eight and a half shoes. Yeah. yeah. Thank you so much for watching Soar. That's our show today. Go honky tonkin. Yes. yes. Let, us know, uh, let us know your favorite types of music too. We'd love to hear. Yeah. yeah. Have a good day. Go soar. 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 soar.